These people promoting meat-heavy diets are profoundly ill-informed. I'm not aware of any research at all showing that meat prevents or protects against cancer. Speaking more broadly regarding animal products, there is some evidence that dairy consumption reduces the risk of colon cancer. But based on that statement alone, I still do not recommend dairy. Why? Well, dairy is linked to both gynecological malignancies and prostate cancer. According to Dr. T. Colin Campbell, Professor Emeritus of Nutritional Biochemistry at Cornell University, the link between dairy consumption and prostate cancer is at least as strong as the link between smoking and lung cancer. The protective element in dairy for colon cancer is thought to be the calcium, probably due to a buffering effect on bile acids. For a lot of people, dairy is a major source for calcium. But instead of consuming dairy, you should get your calcium from plant sources, especially dark green leafy vegetables, which are actively protective against cancer, heart disease, and macular degeneration, which is a major cause of blindness. Meat has no cancer protective phytonutrients, of which there are thousands in plant foods. There is only a minuscule amount of antioxidants in meat compared to plants, and there is zero dietary fiber, which is protective against malignancies of the gastrointestinal tract, as well as a number of non-GI tract malignancies. In an interview that we did with Dr. Furman, he gave the example of lignans, which are an example of just one plant-derived phytonutrient. In a study following women with breast cancer for 10 years, a mere one-third of a milligram of lignans, which you can get from flax, chia, and some vegetables, led to a 71% reduction in the recurrence rate for cancer. Just one teaspoon of flax has 70 milligrams of lignans. Just throw some on your morning oatmeal every day. With a comprehensive plant-based diet, including an array of whole grains, legumes, fruit, veggies, nuts, seeds, mushrooms, and spices, you not only get lignans, but hundreds of other cancer-protective substances. With a meat-based diet, you're getting cancer-promoting substances like heme iron, excessive sulfur-based amino acids, no fiber, etc. Meat-based diet is a lost opportunity to fill your diet with health-promoting anti-cancer foods. And while I think of it, please help us out and like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.